Oh god, Flynn, please! Just get the- Flynn, please! I need the healing so bad! I need healing! Okay, just give me Shining Fane Drop and I'll call it a day. Okay, we finally learned it! Oh my god, dude, we finally learned fucking Shining Fane Drop. Okay, so now I just need to figure out a combo. A, a combo to use, I should say. Okay, yeah, because Carol's not going to be able to do anything here. <laughs> I'm not using that worthless garbage! <laughs> okay, um, well, I mean, shit. You know what I, um, you know what I do have? I actually do have this. I kind of forget that to actually use that. You know, honestly, though, like, unless I'm making a combo video, though, I don't really see a use for, um, doing the shortcut. Hmm. No. Like doing a combo video. <laughs> oh, hey. I can't believe this is Day Nomos, the proof of Imperial secession. Yuri, you can become the Emperor. This is just for decoration. I wouldn't want to be the Emperor even if I could. You're so young, yet you have no ambition. Says the little girl playing dress up. The lost proof of Imperial succession. When you get down to it. The loss of that sword was the source of all the fighting over the succession to the throne. Was Duke really the one who stole it? Hey, hey, give me a break. Don't go saying the Imperial Knights are going to claim this sword. I know. This isn't the time for that. Duke went around using that sword to control Air Crenae. Oh, so Duke's doing the same thing as the Antilochia. Maybe so. That sword... It produced the same phenomenon as Estelle did. Maybe the Rizomata formula was already worked out once before. But then, why was that information lost? Maybe it's related to the Cataclysm, like the way that the Blastia was lost. Why did that become an Imperial treasure? There are tons of things we don't know about this sword. But let's wait to figure them out until we've settled things here. Right now, rescuing Estelle is our top priority. Right, let's hurry. Yeah, you know, honestly, they don't really expand on that, though. Like, I'm pretty sure even in this version, though, they don't even talk about, like, where Duke's from. Like, all that backstory stuff that they could be kind of need to know about. I mean, it's whatever. I mean, they probably don't need to know about it, though, but it still would be kind of nice, you know? All right, cool. <laughs> all for her. Do it for her. I want I want to find that image so I can actually make that one day. Do it for Rita. And then I'll do it for all my other waifus. <laughs> so much for loyalty and commitment. Yeah, I'm, I'm horrible like that. Sorry. Oh, what the hell? That's a new weapon. I've never seen that before. Um, what was it called? Judex. Whoa, what the hell? Reduce the chance of going to a new guard. Oh. That's actually kind of nice, actually. For a mixed, um, for a mixed, like, Flynn. Thing is, though, that Flynn actually doesn't learn AoE, um, heal. Only Estelle's the only one in the game that actually can do that. I mean, Raven, to an extent, can do it, too, with a uh, love shot. But it's still kind of nice. And then Carol. Yeah, I need the nice, um, I need the, the, the more powerful version of nice, uh, 8 smash would be really nice. If I could, I just need to look it up what it is. Also, for some reason, all the, some of the enemies are, like, super shiny. I think it's maybe because they're near the light. Ugh. Yeah, once again, I'm just not looking forward to, um, falling three times and getting a key item that I'll never, like, be able to get again. <laughs> yeah. I think it only happened on this section, though. Like, if you miss out on it, though, you won't be able to get it. Uh. Oh. Uh, uh, well, I guess you... Well, here, Carol. I, I've been ignoring you for a while, but here, man. You can have something good. Alright, so now we can actually... Oh, frick. I was not paying attention. Well, shit. Now I don't have any more ingredients to do any more cooking. No! <laughs> We're fucked, dude. Oh my god. Are you serious? What can I even... Oh my god. Well, I can't do any more of this. That kind of sucks. Well, Flynn, you've, uh... <sighs> well, Flynn, you've, uh, you've, you've extended your use. You're useless to me now. God, are you serious, dude? Well, I've had it, and I can't do any more TP. Oh my god, are you serious? 
All right, Patty, get to it. Please. <laughs> I, I asked nicely. That was the worst part. I even asked nicely. Please. Okay. Please. I think... <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, without any effective ways of healing besides cooking and save points, though. We're, we're so screwed, dude. Ah, oh, God, I wish it, I wish you didn't have a limit on holding items, though. I mean, they fixed that in New Game Plus, but it's New Game Plus. I want to do it now, man. Now! Because I need to buy all the ingredients that I can. Well, maybe they did that so you can't, so you don't go super overload with your spending, like how I usually do. Okay, so I think it's, I think it's just up ahead, the, the maze room. The dark room, I should say. Oh, uh, yeah, here it is. It's not even that dark, though, so... I mean, this it shouldn't be that hard, though, but I'm just gonna do this. Ow. Okay, so this is not voice, though, thank God. <laughs> well, unfortunately, you guys, we're gonna have to be doing this a couple more times, so, uh... Yeah, I'll just make your life easy. Here, we'll, we'll cut to when um, we get the scene. Alright, so, ba <laughs> so basically... <laughs> so basically, at the end of the day, Rita gets really pissed off that you guys are like... <laughs> gets so pissed off at you for like being such a... <laughs> That's a really nice touch. Oh my god. I wonder if it act I wonder if it actually um uh, changes depending on who's in the lead. That's actually a really really nice touch. So with my genius mage and her big ass galaxy brain, the world in the word impossible it just isn't in my vocabulary. Yeah, so she pretty much just makes this amazing lantern which um, will light all the um post in the area. Oh wow, so it's actually like an actual lantern. I thought it would be something special though, but she literally just puts together a just a random like like a basic lantern together. Wow. What a genius. <laughs> yeah, so like see these little posts that you've been seeing throughout the dungeon? They'll automatically be lit up so you can actually just see your way through it a lot easier. I mean, like honestly, like I think it's darker in the 360 version. It looked a lot darker. Uh, I don't remember remember it being so bright before though because I can at least see my way through It's, it's kind of funny that you have to like actually do that I think it's missable too, which is the worst part because you know honestly it's not even that hard to um, navigate your way through So yeah, all the things light up though, so I mean this is literally easy mode I mean, I mean honestly it didn't even look that bad from you know from the beginning so once again Easy. <laughs> Easy. But yeah, it's kind of funny. I wonder if it... I, I have to actually look it up someday. Like, it, if it's different depending on who's in the lead. <laughs> you know, I like, the, I like the call out. <laughs> Carol, read it, but you're the one leading the party. <laughs> and then she goes, like, full sin mode. Hell yeah, that's what I like to see. And hear. And, and, you know, taste. <laughs> I don't know how taste plays into effect, but... Good god, what's wrong with you? Okay, so this is literally the last save point. The boss is literally right up ahead. Or I should say, um, there's a break room here just so you don't, like, run in unprepared. So, that's good. So, money. Oh, heal bracelet. Yeah, well, I mean, that's still pretty good. Considering we won't have a stealth for a while. Okay, excellent. Alright, and that's it. So, next time, we'll go fight the boss and... It's, it's gonna be a doozy. I'm gonna take this opportunity to train too because I'm kind of under leveled. So, yeah, see you next time.